Deja vu! Oopsie. It is still weird that not, this is the only one that seems to wake up and all the other ones are staying on the ground. Anyway, missed a little detail. Hey, chesty, chesty. That is... real. I love you, chain. Titanite scale, yay! One quick loose end wrapped up there. I think that's it. Got a little distracted by the Lord Vessel and everything. Didn't open the chest, but there it is. Okay, I can't help myself. Guess who's gonna get to see soon? Yeah. It feels horrible. It's like if I was if this was a very story-driven RPG where I'm ca making careful story decisions and definitely knew the ramifications, I would totally do it. Also, I, I, mean, I, I mean, I would totally avoid doing this. Also, it'd be this also assumes I'm in a more grounded universe where, like, there's civilizations and governments and people, as opposed to the burning wreckage of generations of loss, which is Dark Souls, where no matter what I do, it feels like bad things are going to happen to everybody anyway. But also, because I'm doing a series and I'm exploring stuff, I just I want to know what the hell happens. Welcome home, so let's find out if I give them the Firekeeper eyes. I haven't been giving them the soul because I think that reverses my hollowing, which I think would ruin the story arc that I literally stabbed someone in the face for, so I'd rather not do that. But uh, let's give her the eyes and see how much it ruins her. Ashen One, are these... Are these eyes? How gracious of thee, Ashen One. The very things we firekeepers have been missing. Ashen One, my thanks for the eyes thou'st given. But firekeepers are not meant to have eyes. It is forbidden. These will reveal through a sliver of light frightful images of betrayal. A world without fire. Ashen One, is this truly thy wish? Dun dun dun! I gave her the eyes, but it didn't trigger anything. They're gone from my inventory. So I should be able to just give her the sigil too. Now the sigil, the firekeeper soul. Ashen one, this is much like what lies within me. Then let it find its own place within my bosom. She will understand. We are both firekeepers after all. Firekeepers now able to heal the dark sigil. Forgive me, sister. May the flames guide thy way. So now she has consumed another firekeeper, basically. So now I can either talk to her about using the flame, I can using the eyes to create a world without flame or head towards that. I can also heal the dark sigil. I don't think I'll do either right now, but there are options. Farewell, Ashen One. Mayst thou thy peace discover. Hey. That's different dialogue than before. Is, is, there, is, there, is there dialogue going to change at all for the Keeper Soul now? Ashen one, my thanks for that fire keepers nope. Are not meant Same eyeball dialogue was before. Hey there, weird dragon location. I'm back. Let's give it a shot. more questions so I passed out and woke up here so the obvious question is is this place even real or was it like was I carried here or did I just is this all a dull dream of some kind also are those piles of rocks or are they dragon poops because they look like dragon poops honestly a lot of weird piles of rocks what do you call that if it's man-made a cairn 
The weird pile of rocks? Oh well, we're here. Welcome to Dragonland of Dragonington. Anyone gonna attack me? That certainly looks like the big mountain I saw in the distance. Maybe not. It's a little, a little hard to tell. I was looking at some kind of tall structure out there. Don't see much around. Definitely a lot of people. Have oh, hey! It's the guys I saw around. What's his name? There we go. Bye bye. Yeah, there's the weird minions beside, behind Osiris's place. Arch Dragon Peak. Hi. No. No, that's not what I want. No soliciting, please. They're stronger than the one behind Osiris. In that they don't die in two hits, they die in four hits. So there's a, there's a hit point gap between the two, it appears. All these column, not quite column are joining, is it? It's kind of just crags. But I'm always on the lookout, damn it. You're not gonna get them past me. This is a huge structure, ooh. That piece of mountain looks like it's floating. Very Castlevania-like in the way that it's just, just kind of levitating there. Praise the sun! Whoa. There's a bell chime. Perhaps to announce my, my presence here? There's also a giant dragon statue up there, which I don't fully suspect to be a statue and totally would expect to have, see it get up and attack me or something. Ow, rude. Anyone else, anyone hiding out here? Hey, look, Homeward Bones. Those are useless to me now. Cool. All right, I am under attack, and this rock doesn't have a texture. <laughs> Whoopsie. What's this, an elevator? It is not currently here. All right, gonna have to bring that back down as a shortcut at some point. Getting a little Nightmare of Mensis vibe from that aspect. Hey, buddy. Ow. Y'all are just being... Y'all are making me feel unwelcome. Ow. 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 Stop it. Stop it. Oh, whoa. Getting a little snaky around here. Gotcha. <laughs> I have resources for this behavior, this type of situation. Hip. Really don't feel like they want me around here, though. How am I doing on shards, by the way? Four. So we have two more to go. Ah. Aha! I win the hitbox game. Take that. Do I need to stock up, by the way? I have 15 shots. Yes, I do. I, I do not have arrows. I don't think they auto-restock, because I think like a hundred of them go into storage when I buy them. And then I don't think those automatically go into my inventory, because I don't feel like I shoot 200. Could be wrong, though. Not exactly constantly... I'm not exactly doing an accounting book for my arrow supply. Hey! Ember, and we have a bonfire. Now I have access to come back here. Try below. Yep. Try below, like going under here. Try dropping down. It seems like a way to die. Unless you're suggesting that there may be a cave under here somewhere. Either way, I don't think I can access it from here. Oh well, try below. Oh hey, look, an item. Yeah, maybe there's something under this area. Tight, there we go, tight that chunk. Just need one more of those. I'll poke around a little bit. Ah, not quite. Oh well. So is the judgment set just missing from this game? Is something I'm starting to wonder. Because the judgment set was one of my favorite things in the in Dark Souls 2 to wear. It was just a cool looking set of robes or whatever. I liked wearing that and a crown and uh, light using a lightning spear on people. But uh, and that was a, that was a nice moment for me in my original in my previous playthrough. But I haven't seen any any hide nor hair of it. Well, that is two chunks. Okay. Well, guess who's gonna go get a plus ten rapier real quick since there's not even a new enemy between this bonfire and where I'm going. I mean, it's only logical. Then I'll be all set for whatever boss comes up next. So all of the dragon people use shotels or shottles or however you pronounce the weird blade. We're halfway down and it just turns into a, a semicircle, which is a strange weapon indeed. Ah. Did what? 
Hello, we are going to reinforce my rapier. All right. So, this will use all six of my Titanite chunks. It'll give me bonus of, st of nine base damage and nine scaling damage. And then I can go straight to 10 with my slab, giving me an additional eight base damage and 10 scaling damage. So in both, I'm getting 18 twice. So I'm getting 36 bonus damage on my weapon just like that. Seems like an obvious use for my slab because obviously it's the weapon I've been using this whole time. And now I'll be happy to, oh yeah, kite. Oh, my kite shield's still in large Titanite territory. Let's fix that. Might as well upgrade its, there, yeah, we're already on chunks on my bow of Ferris. So now as I collect, now as I collect more chunks, I'll be upgrading the stability of my shield so that it requires less stamina to block. I'll be upgrading my bow to do more damage whenever I decide to, to use it. Speaking of which, be sure to stock up on some of those arrows real quick. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, now that we have Arch Dragon Peak at the end here next to Lothric Castle, you definitely get the feeling we're running out of space for zones on this screen. I'll be curious to see if it, to see if it, if it uh, scrolls sideways or if that's the end of it or not. I do, I do appreciate that we're at least on one menu again. Because I got kind of tired of the weird Bloodborne system of... How they split all of your, they split all of your warping points between multiple different, like tombstones. You had to figure out which tombstone was the one that was the right one. And that was just kind of annoying. Well, he looks bigger. I don't like that. And that one looks like it's breathing. So let's fix that. But yay! He stopped breathing. All's right in the world. Let's see if I can sneak up very carefully. I feel like I don't. I feel like I'm missing a slow mode or something. Like I can't quite go as slow as I'd want to. Oh, nope. I think I forgot to get close enough. Oopsie. Boo! Woohoo! No, that's fire. Oh, maybe I can't backstab him. Oh, well. He is down. Top myself off a little bit. And for fear of surprises, large Titanite shard. Alright, well, this was all more connected than I thought. Thought I was doing a side path that would go somewhere else. Well, it's not the case. Howdy. Another ch another chunk, just like that. They're rather easy to find around here. Try left, ring ahead. Jog. Can I use this? Jog. This thing go fast. Hey, look, a bell. What's the bell for? I don't know. I'm going left, though, for the ring. There's a path down here. Hey, little guy. How you doing? Oh, it's so nice to have company out here. Oh, ow, ow! Rude. Rolling did not go according to plan that time. Whoops. Hello. What do we have here? The lightning clutch ring. So, like the other clutch rings, this is going to be an item that makes me more effective with that element, but take more damage in general. Yep, compromises damage or absorption while giving you bonus da lightning damage. Might have some decent value for my uh, lightning build if I do my miracle playthrough. Ring depicting a hand grasping a yellow stone increases lightning attack but compromises da damage absorption. An old fable in Londor claims that the lure of the clutch ring reaches out to Crestfallen who might have otherwise over been overcome by despair. So it's always the same description. They didn't they didn't change the description from like from clutch ring to clutch ring besides saying lightning or dark or fire or whatever the given element is interesting to have those carrying over from dark souls 2 because i think i th think they first showed up in dark souls 2. in fact i think they specifically only showed up in dark souls 2's three expansions where, where the multiple clutch rings showed up is that a boss chamber i don't know what to exp whoa look at these guys those are some crazy looking statues right there all right, there's the dragon statue we saw. Oh, there's multiple. There's a whole bunch of them. There's a ton of dragon statues, and there's tons, tons of these guys' statues everywhere. Doesn't appear to be a boss chamber, as far as I can tell. No drop off. That actually that actually leads to anything over there. Fuck me. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Uh, this is a boss fight. As it turns out. Aha! I've run past your your wackiness. What? Why do you take like a particle of damage? That's concerning. I'm gonna go ring a bell now. Uh 
Eh, that didn't work. Why do you have a billion hit points? What's ow? Whoa, geez. Yep. Welcome back to ancient dragon territory. Oh no, he's he's he is gonna flame the ground under him. He probably has the exact same move set as the freaking wyvern. I mean the ancient dragon. What's his? Yeah, that's not gonna work. <laughs> that's not gonna work. I'm not not unless I'm looking to do a, a ladle run right now. So I don't think I'm supposed to fight him. At least I'm not supposed to fight him with my weapon. I don't think. Amber. Stan dung pies. Huh. I'm gonna die. Right here. Ho 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 ho. Ha 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 ha. Hey, an item. Ring of Steel Protection. Neat. I'm probably gonna die here, right? But we'll look at it anyway in the middle of this boss fight. Don't worry about it, I'm safe. Physical damage absorption increased. King of the Night... Uh, Ring of the Night King of Ancient Legend increases physical damage absorption. The Night King was said to, to be lined with steel on the inside, such that even the talents of Mighty Dragons did little harm. Alright. I have... I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to do here, besides, uh, almost die a lot. So sweet. Don't knock me off with some crazy fire or whatever. Do these, do these all say ring over here? Here! Yeah, they do. Alright, for some reason I'm safe, like, right here. So I should wait for him to do one more fire attack, right? And maybe I'll go for it? No! Wow. They're really forgiving with the hitboxes on these fire attacks in this game. In a way they've never been before in any previous game, basically. Jump attack! Nope, I don't think the ring's gonna work out here. I don't think that ring does what I think it does. He is surprisingly bad at hitting me. For being a dragon in a Dark Souls game where they usually have the most hilariously effective hitboxes. Hey, shield guy. Uh, that guy's probably dead now. <laughs> well, that felt like a trap. <laughs> Let's get around the corner real quick. Oh, shit. Ow. Hot, 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 hot. Hot, 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 hot. Ow. Ow. Shit, 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 shit. Motherfucker. I thought they'd be an easy kill. Just do a quick stab. Like, oh yeah, they're both knocked over. I'll just stab them real quick. They freaking obliterated me for a second there. Alright, so yeah, this... Oh, there's an item over there, isn't there? This does seem to be a crazy scripted sequence. What's this say? Plunging attack. On what, his head or something? Or... Does he see me? Oh yeah, here comes the fire. We'll get that item later. I'm sure he'll I'm sure this guy will die at some point. He has a health bar. Oh, fuck me. Fire's still coming. Alright. Ambush head. Ambush everywhere, right? Oh, whoa! <laughs> trying to look around for them and they come right they came out of the sky like no biggie. Hey. Oh shit. No. No. No eating. That can't, that came as a surprise. Was not expecting the snake monster to repost my attack and start eating me. Oh yeah, they remind me of the snake right sends fortress. It took, it took me way too long to think about that. I was like, why is there snake people in this game? Sends fortress is why. So can I do a plunging attack on the snake monster? Is that what's going on here? I mean the boss, the wyvern. It's like a snake with wings and fire. Oh shit. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Dick. There's that bell again. Hey, wyvern friend. Any more ambushes coming my way? I called this the Arrow of Spite. You earned that. Oh no. Oh no. Is he gonna do that? What I think he's gonna do? Oh shit. I didn't think about that. Oh, hi. Nice to meet you too, sir. No, none of that, please. Huh. Dagger, this bastard. There we go. Huh. Alright. 
Yeah, I was a little freaked out when I shot him with an arrow and then he flew. I'm like, oh no, I made a mistake. Two more chunks. Wow, they're just all over the place around here. Hi. Beware of left. I see him. It's funny. He's, uh... He reminds me of Sense Fortress snakes, for obvious reasons. But the way they're dressed reminds me of those little bastards from Bloodborne that try, that, uh, try to sneak up behind you and slice your throat. Lightning bolt. Lightning bolts are no joke, too. Because, uh... All uh, dragons are weak to lightning. That's the whole gimmick there. That's why... That's the That was Seath's betrayal, was telling Gwyn about that, the weakness of lightning and using it against them and everything. There we go. Is it just like a dead, an end, an end point? Was he gonna be shooting fireballs at me or something? Does it just go right back down? It totally does. Oh, there was just a side path here the whole time, huh? Okay. Let's double check to make sure I'm not missing a block. The music's all dramatic, but I don't think I'm missing much right now. Be wary of left. Yeah, that was the same one. I don't think there's uh, much urgency despite the dramatic music and the ongoing boss fight health bar. So we'll just keep exploring. What does it say? Try a plunging attack. On the, the wyvern or what? Oh, here he comes. Is the fire coming? Oh, is he shooting fire straight at me instead of at the bridge? Interesting. Oh, that big guy. Hey, buddy. Come and get it. Whoa! <laughs> Excuse me? I didn't see that coming. Got a chain sword with super range. I guess they've all had the chain, huh? I've just never fought them at a range where they'd be able to use it properly. Come on, do your do your nice fire spell. Give me a healing opportunity. Uh oh. Shit. Shit. I'm dead. Damn it. I blew it there. That, <laughs> that chain was a surprise. <laughs>